with its understated moniker, the Hulk stands out among some of its more flamboyant counterparts, Sakura Baby, Lavabar, and Baby Girl. But their differences stop there. Behind the wheel of these vibrant vehicles, their drivers are bonded by an equal fervor for the subculture that originated in Japan and brought them together. Known as the Katora, the Japanese term is a portmanteau of decorated truck. While their flashy convoy is often caught cruising down Little India, every deeper valley, to ring in the festival of lights, a group of drivers named Team Superman told CNA their love for Dikatura extends beyond aesthetic appeal. For many of them, often on the go as prime mover drivers, the truck is their sanctuary for the other 364 days of the year. Every day, half the time we're in our lorry. It's our second home. So why not decorate to feel more comfortable inside, said Mr. K. Ganesh, house driver. The 28-year-old from Indian Wedding Decorations Company SGS was exposed to Japanese culture through the Katora, which he discovered through his childhood friend only four years ago. But he has since boldly decked out his truck to showcase his personality. His curtains, blue flowers on a white base, are retro because they are no longer in production. He said proudly. Currently, the same curtains only come with white flowers on a blue base. And how might someone describe Mr. K. Ganesh just by looking at his decorations? Someone who's very outgoing. Fun and jovial, he concluded. Meanwhile, Mr. Megan, who declined to give his full name, may be seen as more sentimental. The 22-year-old fell in love with Dikatora after he visited an expo event about Deeper Valley when he was 12 and became a prime mover driver to pursue this passion. Like other drivers, his truck's interior is adorned with blue and white prints. He, however, picked the color combination because he believes white makes the space look bigger. And strapped into his passenger seat is a matching blue and white penguin plushie that accompanies him on long drives. Definitely, decorating our trucks makes us feel less homesick. Nobody would want to stay in a vehicle. When we get down from the lorry, we might not feel like working, but when we get back into the lorry, we feel like working again. It's our motivation, he said. As long as I'm in my lorry, I'm happy. If my company gives me another lorry, I feel very uncomfortable. Because it's not something I have taken care of. While Team Superman has about 90 members. Including drivers from Malaysia and India, not all are prime mover drivers. Excitedly showing off the cozy interior of his van, which he affectionately named Baby Girl, Mr. Bola Prashant said embracing Dikatora was a natural progression. The 25-year-old owner of RKB Logistics became interested in the subculture from a young age, thanks to family and friends. I feel like it's my own personal space inside the van. Whether I'm sad or happy, I'm inside my vehicle. People say we spend money, but we don't spend money for fun. It's a passion, he explained. Leader of Team Superman and a former prime mover driver, Mr. Tiban Mohindran said he spent about 5,000 Singapore dollars decorating a smaller truck and at least 8,000 Singapore dollars on a larger truck. The 29-year-old, who has since sold off his decorations, has even appeared in Japanese magazines for his decatora devotion. Drivers told CNA that many are willing to splurge on decorations as these revamps don't happen frequently. Their love for Dikatora has given them more than a physical home away from home. In particular, they relish driving down Little India, every deeper valley, to the cheers of crowds that show up specially to catch the blink and you miss it appearance. Many feel a sense of belonging by giving back to their community through the parade. With the informal event kicking off just before midnight, 
Mr. T. Band, noted that some people would hang around until 1 a.m., as his team Superman typically makes up the final convoy. They call us the big boys because we have the bigger trucks. The other groups are all cars, bikes, vans, he said. For some drivers, it is surreal being behind the wheel, having once been part of the audience, waiting in anticipation. I'm happy to be the driver now, bringing joy to the community. I feel very satisfied, like they're waiting there for us. Once we go through, they cheer for us, said Mr. Boller. Mr. K. Ganesh, who has been with the convoy over the past four years, added that the drive through is fun for drivers. There are, after all, similarities between Deeper Valley and their trucks. At home, when you decorate, you will hang lights. Same thing here, this is like our second home, he said, but stressed that they only drive through once and immediately remove their decorations afterwards. A lot of people including tourists will come down to Little India just to see this. Plus with the Little India decorations and lights, people will be cheering. It's a very nice feeling. From the passenger set next to Mr. K. Ganesh, this CNA reporter had a front row view of his joy as the crowd waved and hooped. The journey took minutes but lasted more.